Hey Frag Fam, two minute fragrance review on Boss Bottled Night, 2010 release from Hugo Boss in their Boss Bottled series. I don't get the DNA of the original, that apple pie, and I don't care when the uh, flanker has no, none of the original DNA. I'm like, just make it a one-off fragrance. But anyways, um, this is car uh, categorized as a woody aromatic. Top notes are lavender and birch. You can definitely smell both of those in the top. The violet in the middle also comes through on the opening. Now, the thing about it is, is to me, I think it's classified wrong. It opens like a mixture of a fougere and a blue fragrance. It has a very fresh shower gel vibe opening to it um, that probably many people would find mass appealing, but unique and different. It doesn't really smell like any other blue fragrance or fougere or woody aromatic for that instance. Now, there is a con to it that I don't care for is that it's got this waxy, dusty vibe that I also get from like Lalique Ancre Noir line. Um, there's just something in it that it, it's a little synthetic -y, waxy, and dusty is the only way I know how to describe it. Um, this thing dries down, though, like a, an 80s fougere, patchouli and oat moss, neither of which is listed in the notes, but the thing dries down like an 80s powerhouse again. Um, Performance-wise, it's average. You know, it's, it's going to open up average but projection wise the thing is a beast i could smell it 12 hours uh as a skin scent and i'm not talking about faint i'm talking about still strong after 12 hours so um you may like this fragrance uh I, i've got samples you can get one um again boss bottled night i would like to have had a little amber a little vanilla in the base to round it out widen it out but didn't get it anyways it's a uh, an average fragrance. I would give it a, maybe a seven out of 10. Uh, check us out down the road, like, and subscribe. Frag on, frag fam. God bless. We'll see you.